Okay, welcome to tonight's homework help for Monday night, September 17th, 2012. Uh, tonight we're working with operation vocabulary. So we're using vocabulary that we use in relation to operations. Uh, the instructions read, choose the number that accurately completes the sentence. Then prove each answer. That's what we call showing your work. So here we have the sum of 8 and 4 is, well, sum I know means addition. So 8 plus 4 equals 12. So that means that the answer is 12. Okay? Um, let's see here. Uh, just as a reminder, product means multiplication. Difference means subtraction. Quotient means division. And product is, is multiplication again, and difference is subtraction. We have some more down here. Uh, product multiplication, subtraction, division, addition, addition, multiplication, division. Oh, nope, that's subtraction, and that's division. Okay, on to the other side. Okay, now on to the back side, we have half and half. These shapes show halves. One half of the shape is colored, and one half of the shape is uncolored. So they're talking about these shapes up here. Uh, here we have four blocks. Two of them are shaded, and two of them are not shaded. So yes, they can be split in half. Two shaded plus two unshaded equals four. Here we have four blocks, and we have two shaded there and two unshaded there. Two shaded plus two unshaded equals four. So we circle yes. Again, four blocks, two are shaded, two are not shaded, so we can say two shaded plus two not shaded equals four. Circle yes. These shapes below here do not show halves. Well, we have five uh, blocks, three of them are shaded, two are not. Three plus two equals five. That is not sh cut in half. Again, here we have five, one, two, three that are shaded, two that are not shaded. 3 shaded plus 2 not shaded equals 5, but they cannot be split in half, okay? So now let's read the directions down here. Um, looks like, look at the three shapes below. Find out if you can color in one half of the shape. Circle yes or no below the shape. Then write an addition sentence that describes how you colored in the shape. So. Here you'd have to see if you can shade in half of the half of the um, the squares and then leave the other half unshaded. If you can, then you should be able to write down uh, one number plus itself equals the total number of blocks that you have here. Okay, and so you're gonna have to do this with all three of these. Okay, so what I'll do is I'll go ahead and do one uh, number one for you. And I'll, I'll show you that I can shade in uh, one square, uh, another square over here. Say I shade in this square over here and this square over here. So I've got one, two, three, four blocks shaded and one, two, three, four unshaded, which means four plus four equals eight. Okay, you may come up with a completely different solution for this problem as well as these ones and these ones, okay? Um, oh, I didn't circle that yes, that can be split in half. So that's what you're circling is if it can be split in half or not evenly, okay? Um, I hope this helps, uh, and uh, give us a text or a call if, it, if you need further help, okay? Thanks, and good night. Go Bears! Rawr!